Minnesota Vikings bringing Alabama safety Brian Branch in for a visit. Hell yeah. Welcome back to One Bar and Lapagas Show. I am Lapagas, and Minnesota Vikings bring in one of my favorite players, potentially for a first-round pick for the Vikings in Alabama safety, Brian Branch. Hell yes, let's make it happen, Vikings. Uh, before we talk about Brian Branch and him visiting with the Vikings, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you have not yet done that. Uh, we are over 9,100 subscribers, so thank you to everybody who has hit that subscribe button, and we encourage anybody who hasn't to, to try it out. It feels really good. All right, so... Brian Branch visiting the Vikings. Uh, this is a much more exciting top three visit than the last couple we've done because of the impact this guy could have in year one. Now, you look at this and think, why the hell would the Vikings go safety in round one back to back? Well, Brian Branch is much more than a safety, so much more than a safety. He is a versatile weapon. And you look at Brian Flores. What did he say when he came here? He said, I want players who are versatile, who can do many different things, who can be used in a variety of ways. Brian Branch is the perfect fit for that. He can play deep safety. He can play nickel corner. He even played some linebacker at Alabama. There's so many things you can do with this kid. So versatile, so damn good uh, that it's just it, it just it makes so much sense on so many different levels. So if Brian Branch were to be drafted by the Vikings in the first round, I think he would come in as a nickel corner. Brian Murphy would probably go to the outside, and then you'd look for you know the other guy to be booth evans whoever so i think that's how it work and you know he, he can blitz you look at his stats i mean alabama, alabama career stats 111 total tackles actually my bad 172 total tackles 19 and a half tackles for a loss that shows you he is attacking he has four sacks which is pretty damn impressive three interceptions so uh very productive 23 pass breakups 23 pass breakups uh this is the guy i, I think if you don't go d-line and you do go with the defensive back i would love the vikings to go the brian branch route uh, I think it makes so much damn sense. Um, so, you know, one thing with Brian Branch, I mean, the combine, I thought he was going to blow that thing on the water. Didn't really have the workout many were expecting. He ran a, I have it right here. He ran a 4, 5, 8, 40, 34 and a half inch vert, vert and a 10 and a half broad, only 14 on the bench press. Uh, so really, you know, they score, when you go to NFL.com here, they score um, each thing. And his production score was 96. His athleticism score was a 67. So that didn't exactly get uh, the arrow pointing up for Brian Branch after the combine. He's kind of a name that's been flying under the radar. You see him mock to the Vikings every now and then. And really, in the first round, he doesn't always go there. He's like a late first rounder to an early second, a lot of mocks. And that's probably where he will come off the board. Um, but you look at his read up on him, and they just say there's no weaknesses to his game. I mean, he is just solid all around he's very very smart very high football iq and again that versatility tougher than he looks he's physical uh again if if you aren't going d-line don't go wide receiver those are pick clean and brian branch is sitting there this is a very very nice consolation prize for the vikings at pick 23 and one we should all keep on our radar especially now with his top 30 visit brian branch in purple hell yes i'm on board let me know what you guys think of brian branch Drop it in the comments, and remember to always keep your skull in your hole.